To drive the car is pretty awesome. I mean, I, obviously, I didn't know what to expect. I mean, I've only really been used to driving World Rally cars. And, um, yeah, it is it is just like a mini WRC car, basically. Um, it feels really, really light and nimble. I mean, obviously, wheelbase is a lot shorter. Um, but it's um, I've really, really enjoyed it. And the Super 2000 engine is brilliant fun because, obviously, your high revs and the noise and everything is really, really nice to hear. So... No, for me, it's been um, a good challenge, and like, I've really, really enjoyed driving it. It's been, uh, been good fun. The handling-wise, I mean, it, it's, um, it feels really, really easy to drive, to be honest. I mean, and very, very stable. It's surprising, such a small car, how stable it is. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you do start to get it slightly sideways, it, it comes back straight so quick. Um, so yeah, it's um, quite impressive. I mean, like I say, I, I had no prior experience of anything like that. So um, it's been a bit of a shock to me how, how good and how stable it is. I think now, I think we've created a really good ladder. I mean, you can come from driving an R2, um, which is going to give you a really good feeling and get you in the right direction. And then you can come into a, a Super 2000, learn even more, um, and then you, know, you end up in, in a WRC. So that there is a real definitive ladder there now. And um, I think we're probably you know, Ford's the only manufacturer to do that. So it's... Um, it's good if, you, if you're starting out, you know exactly where to go and you can keep in a Ford the whole way.